Hello everybody, Get a Hinge Productions here. This is going to be a, not so much a rant, more as a informational video for you guys. Um, uh, I may not go live until I can figure out what I want to do with my channel. Uh, I, I don't exactly have a direction. It started off being uh, that I want to I want to make something of myself. I want to become bigger than myself. You know, something that other people know me for. Um, it wanted to be. It was more or less something. Um, raise this up a little bit. More or less something to just have fun. Making money was a thing. This is before the ad apocalypse and people actually made some kind of coinage on their videos, um, which obviously doesn't happen now. Um, I've never made that much money out of any of my videos. Um, and uh, there's just a lot of stuff eating away at me. Um, I may wait until I get a new game to play. Uh, and then I'll have a focus and something. Um, I tell you what, though, you know, playing Grand Theft Auto is great and all, but honestly, once you have everything, it's boring. Doing the same thing, you're doing things not because you need it, but because you want to. And uh, I tell you what, it's it's fun to have all the fun toys. It's fun to keep you guys entertained with having fun toys. But unless you're having fun, there's really no point in doing it. Um, I've been depressed lately. Really, just life in general. Um, you know, uh, at what point does making content that I think is enjoyable and everything else turn into... I'm doing it because I need to do something different. Um, I've mentioned before, uh, I work two jobs. You know, I, I try. I work two jobs because we were struggling, and we still do. We still struggle, even with me working two jobs and my wife working one. Um, and you know, it's it's hard. It's hard not being home. My daughter always misses me, stuff like that, and. Uh, I was really hoping that when I had my free time, I would go on and stream for you guys and, and um, you know, try to make some kind of some a name for myself and then eventually get to the point where I can start making money on YouTube, um, whether it's through donations or just ad revenue, you know, stuff like that. But, uh, you know, I don't I don't demand any kind of payment I don't I don't I don't shove it down your guys's throat and I've done a lot better at not asking um, it's down in the description I have a patreon if you want to help me out but it never fails the phone every time I do one of these um, but lately I don't know if you guys noticed it's summertime and I was really expecting when school was out, summertime would be the time to stream, get all those, all the, all the kids, all the adults, any kind of person that wanted to view content, and show up, and uh, it'd be great, you know. Um, problem is that nobody's showing up. Uh, I've been told by numerous YouTubers now, uh, ideas and thoughts of what I should do, um, as far as like. You know, go out, find a stream team, people that I can stream with all the time. It's difficult when you work two jobs. Uh, it, it's very hard to find scheduling that works. Uh, it's very hard to find people that have the same game as you. Um, they have the same kind of mindset. Uh, it's hard to find people of your age or older or younger that not only have a decent microphone, um, they don't scream into the microphone and they don't have background. No, I mean, there's a lot of factors that come into finding a perfect team to work with you. And I, it's been a couple, it's been a few days. I mean, I, I know things don't happen overnight. 
but like I've, I, this is not the first time I've tried. I've tried in the past, and I haven't gotten anywhere. Um, now, if you are one of my subscribers that have had those issues where you have a bad mic or you have noise in the background and stuff like that, I, I'm not harping on you in a sense of I don't want you to come back. I don't want to play with you. That's not the case. The case is trying to find a team like most of these YouTubers got. They don't have that noise in the background. It's focused on the gameplay. Because a viewer is going to hear the noise and then it's going to distract them from the game and whatever. Um, but, uh, you know, at, the, at this point, like, going back to the job thing, I work two jobs. I'm also in risk of losing both of them. Let that sink in. Here, here's the dilemma. Okay, and I, I mentioned this on my Facebook. I mentioned this on my Facebook page because I, I, you know, posted it on my main, my, my actual profile, and then my Facebook. And then I sent a link on Twitter, but many people don't read these things. So basically, the thing said that I'm in a rock and a hard place. I'm never home, and when I am home, I'm in my game room trying to uh, post somewhat enjoyable content for you, the viewers. And uh, I don't feel like I'm meeting that goal. Um, this is not a I'm quitting YouTube. This is a I'm taking a very long break. Uh, I need to figure out what content uh, I need to play. Um, God, there's just that one thing that I really don't want to want to talk about. But it's eventually going to be found out. Um, I don't. I don't exactly have seventeen hundred and sixty-one subscribers. That's that's not a true number of subscribers that I have. Call this a self-exposed video, but that number is is very very inaccurate um, when my channel was smaller and when I was more YouTube naive my mindset was get some subscribers and the views will follow so my mindset was how do you get more subscribers easily Go to those shout out channels. Sure, that'll work temporarily until, you know, a day passes and they unsubscribe. But, uh, one other way is to buy them. And I may have done. Um, was it worth it? It seemed like it. Is it worth it now? No. Because it's not the amount of subscribers you have, it's the amount of views you have. And I don't have that many. So, moving forward from now on, um, I'm only going to stream when I got an idea for content. Uh, I'm not quitting. Because if I quit, like I told you, all you guys many, many times before, if I quit, I'm repaying everybody that paid me up money. And I, I just feel like it would be the right thing to do. So, you know, I'm just... Um, if I post content, it'll be just uploads. It won't be live stream. Um, I've had many YouTubers tell me, well, engage with your audience. 
How? Am I supposed to engage with an audience that does not comment? I have four or five people watching. Nobody comments. I don't know how to engage in an audience that does not want to engage back. Um, whatever the case may be, if you just like watching, that's cool. Just say hey, you know. Let me know how you how you doing. Um, but like I said, it's very hard to engage with a silent audience. How do you have fun doing what you're doing with the two people you're playing with on a game? And try and go involve your audience so they feel like they're worth being there. Uh, I just... I'll have up to nine people watching at one point, and it was great. Five of them at least would be talking. One of them would be me, because I always watch my stream so I can hear it, see what it looks like. I always got a way to look at the chat. Um, but nobody ever gives me feedback. I, I thrive on the feedback that I get off my content. Hey, I liked what you did here. Or, hey, this was a good idea. You should do more of this. Hey, why don't you play this game some? And why don't you play that game? I'm sorry I'm not a horror game. I'm sorry I don't like first-person shooters. Um, I don't have suspense games. I have games like... I have games like Sword Art Online, I have racing games, I have general idea of games. I mean, I don't have any of the newest newest released games that are out there. Uh, I played the crap out of Horizon Zero Dawn, I love that game, the game is coming out with an expansion, um, Need for Speed, Payback's coming out, World War II is coming out, all these are games that I plan on playing, but they're not out yet. And once I get these games, I'm going to start streaming the crap out of them because they're new. Nobody's watching the old content. Uh, these YouTubers that are streaming the old content, like GTA, Black Ops, they're good at the game. There's a reason they're being watched. They're good at the game. Um, I went to watch one of my, subscri one of my uh, subscribers slash people I watch, and... He's playing Black Ops, and he's got like 30, 40 people in his channel. Because he's good. He talks with his subs, yes, but he's really good at the game. Um, you watch all these big YouTubers that are playing some Grand Theft Auto game or some old game. It's either because they're good at the game or because they've gotten such a big fan base. I've watched YouTubers with as many subscribers as I supposedly have and they got 20 people reason my live streams are not a active is because I do not have as many subs as you guys think I have I cannot give you an accurate number of how many I do have because I don't know um, I thank everybody that comes and raids me they throw a subscribe on my channel to watch the channel counter go up while their favorite YouTuber comes in and raids. But then they disappear, which is understandable. They hit the subscribe button, they like the content, but then they take a look at my channel and go, how does he have that many subscribers? It's because they're not active. Um, I know this is a really long video. This is not supposed to be a pity party video. I'm just explaining that um, I just don't enjoy it anymore. I'll sit on, in this chair for hours thinking about live streaming. What am I going to put on? Will anybody be there? Is it worth it? You know, me being in here all day long. I have not watched a single bit of television in months. Um, I keep playing the same game over and over again. Um, there is that very few dedicated that come to every stream. And you guys are the greatest for doing it. 
I'm not expecting everybody in my channel to always be in my stream. That's not what I'm saying. What I'm saying is, you know, if you come to the stream, chat with me. I don't care what it's about. As long as it's nothing personal, I don't care what it's about. Uh, things are things happen unexpectedly. Like I did a stream, music cut out, says I wasn't connected to the internet while I was streaming from the computer that is said I did not have internet on. I can't explain that at all. Uh, I find it very awkward. So of course, once the music's done and there's silence in between me talking. What's the sense in watching? The gameplay is not that good, and the music is stopped, and the YouTuber that is streaming doesn't talk all the time. I'm not one of those like Bobby V. I'm going to I'm going to shout out his name because you guys need to watch him. Bobby V, my suppressor official, uh, Vengeance Media. You guys, these guys that are out there, whether their chat is dead, they always find something to talk about. You guys are amazing. I cannot do that. I don't know why. I'm the most chattiest person in the world. But when it comes to coming up with content, I blank out. I have nothing. I can talk about my day until there's nothing else to talk about. I worked my job. It was boring. Yada yada. I get home. I sat in this chair and can contemplate a live stream. That's short and sweet. I mean, there's nothing else you want. I, I can't do an hour by hour, day by day play. Uh, I can't tell you what I'm planning on doing tomorrow because I my plans never work out. I used to do vlogs. I got a 360 camera to do vlogs. I don't have content. I don't know what to stream in 360. I don't want to do it around my neighborhood because you don't want to do that. You don't want to stream your neighborhood. There's weirdos out there that'll want to do something. Going to the park, I don't, have, I don't really have time, nor do I have the want to go to the park. Nothing there. Nothing there to do. I don't have a bike. I can't go bike riding. I can't take you guys on a bike ride and enjoy the sun. I don't have this. What I do have is a certain set of skills. <laughs> um, I've just been really down on top of possibly losing both my jobs. The trailer park, if they raise the rent again, I can't afford to live here. I, I'm just constructed, you know, constricted so much that it's just gonna pop one day and I'm gonna I'm just gonna lose it I'm gonna lose everything that I have I'm gonna lose every sense of sense that I have and it scares me and I, I play games to take my mind off of real life events but my ADHD kicks in stops me from doing things that I want to do and I just I don't know where to go from here. I really don't. Um, so guys, I, like I said, I'm not quitting YouTube. I got a piece of hair in my eye. I'm not quitting YouTube, nor do I want to quit YouTube, but until I can come up with some new content to make it interesting for you guys, I'm going to be taking a very long break. If you guys want to chat with me, I'm always up for a chat. Discord, Twitter, Facebook, you name it, do it. Talk to me. Um, I'm going to try to focus on my book and try to get my artist to focus on you know, finishing chapter one. I'd like to share it with you guys, but until it's done, I can't share anything because I don't have it. So... Um, I was supposed to do a fidget spinner giveaway in June, but the 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 views aren't there. I'm not going to get anybody to show up to the stream, and it, it's just going to be another flop. So I still have them 
probably for the rest of eternity until my daughter finds them and plays with them. So, um, with that all said, you guys, judge me all you want. Tell me I, you know, I'm dishonest because I bought subscribers, which doesn't help me. It's just a number. Um, it's the views that count. And no, I'm not going to go and buy views. It's just, that's stupid. It, that doesn't help me either. They're not actual views. That's some kind of bot that just refreshes a page a thousand times. You know, it, it's not worth it. I don't make that much money anyway. Um... So, until I come up with a new game, I will let you guys know in advance. Follow me on Facebook and Twitter, and I'll let you guys know when I come up with a new game. If I decide to do another vlog or another rant about something I think about, then I will let you guys know. But until then, thank you so much for supporting me, you guys. Uh, it, it's been a real treat. And I really, really hope you guys stick around for a while it would mean a lot so until next time neko fam just got oddly emotional that was weird uh I will talk to you guys in my next video. Thanks.